back to the channel for the next episode of our CFM series with the Denver Broncos. We are 5-1, and one, coming into week 7 already against the New York Jets. Devontae Adams, Stephon Gilmore, and Kenny Clark lighting it up for the Jets, who are, I believe, they're 2-5. and five. Or they're like 2-4, and 1-4, 1-5, something like that. They, they're not the best team right now. But we'll see what they do against us. We're already in the in the red zone. We already scored a touchdown. Defense needs your help. What's going on here? They come back and score a touchdown on us. They go four down, four down, and they get it. The Jets are up on us, fourteen to seven, and we're finally hopping in midway through the second quarter. It is third and two on the six. And what else are we going to do? We're going to run the ball with Joe Mixon and let him cook. Let's see what he does here. Whoa! He can't get there. He gets stopped. What's going on here? They want us to keep the drive alive and go for it. Um, okay. So we are going to fourth and two. Get there, Joe. Get there, Joe. He can't get there. He gets stuffed. Turnover on downs. This is not good. That does not look good for our team at all. There's going to be momentum shift going the other way. We do get the ball back, though, and we do score a touchdown. Um, big third down stop. They do get the field goal as well. And we miss a field goal, it looks like. <laughs> we should have gotten that. I don't know. I should. I, do I really have to jump in and kick field goals? I, apparently I do, I guess. Like, that's just what it's going to be. Third and five. Can't convert. Okay, we get that field goal, which is good. But they just come back and score on us. Um, I'm not a fan of this right now. Third and five. We need to get a stop. They don't get it. They don't get it. We do stop them. Okay. We are in the red zone. Third down and four. Joe Mixon. Mixon, baby! Getting in there. All right, we scored the touchdown. We get what we need to do. The game is on the line here. Oh, man. We need to get a stop. Yuck. Are they running the ball here? They're not. That was dumb on them. Why are they not just... Why would you not just uh, run the ball? We needed that. We needed to stop them there, and they ran the ball right on us like they should have been doing be before, and we are losing this game, it looks like. They are just going to run the ball out now, probably. Unless we can get some kind of a stop here or something miraculous happens. We're going to call a timeout. We're going to burn up our timeouts here. Third and goal. How are they doing? They're passing the ball. No way! And he didn't get there! That saves us a timeout. And we are going to, they're going to kick a field goal, and it's going to be 37-31. We're going to have an opportunity, folks. We have a shot at, this is it. We're going to have one last drive, potentially one last drive here, to actually do some work. 
Okay, we start on the 25. It was a touchback on the kickoff return. Kirk Cousins needs to go to work with the team here. We have 75 yards. We got to go. The clock is a ticking. Can we do it? Oh, he's open again. No, no. Oh, I thought that had interception written all over it, folks. Yikes. This is scary stuff here, folks. Oh, no. Get there. Oh, no. Third and ten. Who's going to be open? Dalton, maybe? If we put him on the slant? No. D-Hop with the big catch, the big first down catch. Oh, he threw out of the sack, which is good for him. But man, this is getting intense. 35 yards to go still. Curtis Samuel. Thirty-two seconds left in the game. <sighs> oh boy. Oh, okay, four seconds. Okay. Can we get in there? He got it! With two seconds left! With two seconds left! <laughs> and we did it! Woo! What a ending! What a drive by Kirk Cousins and the Denver Broncos to come back and get a big, huge, gigantic win. What a crazy win! For our Denver Broncos, wow. It just shows you, like, when they stop the run, that's what happens. Like, I do want to see real quick, just to see what we did. Kirk Cousins, 410 yards, five touchdowns, zero interceptions. And we're playing against Tua. Kareem Hunt had 164 yards on the ground. Joe Mixon did not have his best game by far. Tyler Lockett coming back from the dead, putting up work. Nine catches, 129 yards, and a touchdown. And D Hop getting securing the game winning touchdown at the end there. What a crazy game. No interceptions thrown by either team. Jalen Ramsey got a half a sack. <laughs> Were there any fumbles? No fumbles for the game either. What a game. Uh, thank you guys very much for watching, and I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I sure had a good time making this one. Thank you very much, and I'll see you guys next time.